So Colin, I'm familiar with the success Nextivity has had with its Selfie product line in the US. I was hoping you could tell me a little bit about what's going on in the UK. Yes, yeah. So as you say, we've, we've experienced uh, rapid growth in the US market across the entire Selfie range into both uh, mobile operators and integrators. Um, what, what's possibly not so well known is that we actually started the Selfie business in Europe with operators like Vodafone, Orange and uh, Telenor. Uh, and we're now approved by some 200 operators in 100 countries. Um, so in, in Europe, that uh, traditional business with the mobile operators continues to grow for us. Um, and, uh, we're, but we're expanding our team to also cover a sort of new market into enterprise, which we're starting to see develop with the uh, loosening up of some of the regulators. Yeah, you mentioned regulations. Uh, I know there's some moving pieces with Ofcom right now. What's the impact to uh, Selfie? That's right. So o Ofcom have been looking at strategies around improving connectivity in the UK. And after a long consultation period, they've uh, introduced a new specification for license exempt repeaters. Uh, and what this means is that it sort of opens up uh, the market for, for us into uh, enterprise customers as well as uh, uh, into uh, the operator customers. You know, we're here in Barcelona for Mobile World Congress. I'm curious what sort of traction you've been receiving during the show. Well, it's, it's been excellent, I have to say. We've, uh, we've had wall-to-wall -wall meetings. There's been typically five of us here and uh, our meeting room's been booked out for the entire time and we've been uh, having meetings outside the stand here as well using the, uh, the, the wall graphics to continue with our meetings. So it's just been, it's been full on and uh, to be honest, I've had no opportunity to walk around the event this year. I normally spend half a day sort of getting around and seeing what everybody else is doing, but, but this year it's just been too busy for us. It sounds like a good problem, Colin. I uh, it's, you. Yeah, it's a nice one to have, absolutely. Well, thank you for keeping us up to date on what Nextivity is doing in Europe. Well, so what, one thing I should uh, just add though is we're, we're launching uh, a product this year at, um, at the Barcelona show now. Uh, it's an extension to our range called uh, Solo. It's based around our award-winning uh, IntelliBoost uh, chipset and uh, it, it uh, follows the, the sort of family benefits, if you like, of um, having uh, unconditionally network safe performance. So this is important in terms of ensuring to the mobile operators that we do not interfere with their networks, but it's actually a critical part of the Ofcom regulations as well. Uh, ease of installation and um, best performance in, in the category. But in addition, uh, we've introduced uh, more flexibility around the installation, more capacity on the system, uh, and also the ability to remotely manage uh, the, the, the system from our, uh, our cloud platform called uh, Wave. So as you've put this new product in front of potential customers, what's the early reaction? Uh, it's, it's been exceptional, to be honest. I mean, you know, a lot of, the, a lot of our customers and a lot of the operators are obviously used to Selfie, so they understand the name, they understand our uh, proposition to them and, and uh, what our design philosophy is. Uh, so taking this step forward with the, with the solo products opens up uh, new opportunities for, for us, but also for, uh, for our installation communities and also the operators as well. So I think it's a great step forward uh, and uh, the, the reaction has been exceptionally positive. Okay, that's great to hear. Thank you, Colin. Okay, thank you very much.